Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelly, if you have not yet been here. I have not made a video in probably since early December. Um, the videos that you may have seen coming out are just videos that I had on my phone. As many of you may know, my father passed away, so it's been kind of a bad time for me lately. Um, you know, we're all recovering. It's gonna be a process. I know I did end um, last time with a giveaway, uh, which I never did pick a winner for. I am aware of that. In fact, some um, someone in a video, I think it was the daily goodie box video I posted because you know you gotta post those, otherwise you don't get them free anymore. But I did um, post a video last month of the daily goodie box. Someone in my comments. Um, even after explaining that my father passed away, somebody in the comments said, and this is the only thing that person said, you never pick the winner of your giveaway. Um, I'm aware of that. Yes, I'm well aware of that. That person is no longer eligible for any of my giveaways, period. And all of the aliases that that person has been using. Um, which I think I know a couple. I don't um, want to give names out there, but if you go back to my daily goodie box um, video, you can see for yourself in the comments below who left that message. Just to let other YouTubers know out there, it was very, very rude, I thought, at the moment. Um, I've realized that when people have giveaways, there's always a time when the giveaway ends and it's very exciting, you know, I get that, I understand that. But that was bad timing. It was a rude comment and it was not appreciated at all. So moving forward, I do plan on getting my channel back to growing as it was. I did lose some subscribers um, during these last two months, but that was to be expected, I get it. Um, if you uh, resubscribe to me once I start giving giveaways again, I'm not entering you. It's just not going to happen. I'm sorry. It's just, it's just not. So, but today, um, after all it, that is said and done, I do have a giveaway uh, that I did leave off, off on. I don't even know what I'm trying to say, but I will be picking that winner. I will be within the next couple days. I'll try to do that today and get it posted. But for right now, I'm gonna show you some mystery bags, kind of mystery bags, that I got from Goodwill. Now these are like Christmassy because I bought all of these before Christmas. My father did pass away on December 23rd. Um, I was going to uh, record all this and get all this posted by Christmas, but of course that didn't happen. So let me go ahead and first of all, we'll start off with this one. A lot of these um, have, you know, stationary type things like cards, greeting cards, birthday cards, um, and uh, pads to, to write on. And so let me go ahead and this one was $3.88 for this little bundle here. Don't worry, I'm not gonna bore you with every single card because sometimes I get um, these bags and they're full of greeting cards. So let's see. First thing I got was this little box of cards. It is still sealed, uh, completely sealed all the way around. It tells me it's never been opened, I hope. And it is a hummingbird, um, blank interior, so they're blank cards. And it's 14 cards and 15 designer envelopes. So that's kind of nice. Actually, it's very, oh, look, it is open. Oh, I was wrong. It felt like it was totally closed until I did that. Okay, well, let's see. It's supposed to have 15. It has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so somebody's gotten into it. But that's okay, it still has seven cards. It came in a cute little box that Brooklyn's trying to eat. Um, in case you don't know who Brooklyn is, she is my Yorkie. 
She is always, always, always helping me unbox things. She loves when I unbox things. This is the first time I've unboxed anything in a while. So she's like, yay. So, all right. Next. We've got these. It says dragonfly note cards with a blank interior. It's also supposed to have 14 cards. Um, I will not be fooled again. Let's see how many cards are in this one. It sure doesn't look like 14. Let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's eight. There's eight. So, but they're cute. You know, it's just little blank note cards. Okay, so there's two packages of note cards in this so far. And let's see what else I got. Here's some more greeting cards with envelopes in the back here. So there's some, um, I'm not gonna bore you, don't worry with all of the stupid little cards, but there's birthday cards, a couple of them. There's thinking of you cards here. There's an, another um, birthday card, uh, get well soon cards. Um, let's see, uh, this is just another one, get well soon. So there's just a variety of cards here. This one's really pretty, birthday wishes. So that is just a bunch of greeting cards. Again, um, you know, these oftentimes have a lot of these greeting cards. I need to sort through mine and get them sorted into birthday, Christmas, Easter, get well soon. You know, those sort of, I've got to start sorting them because I have gotten so many. Okay, and then I've got two longer cards here. Let's see. My dog wants to eat it. No, Brooklyn. So this one is um, sending birthday wishes. And it's got the matching envelope. And this one is um, another, uh, have a wonderful birthday. And then it's got a matching envelope. So that's pretty, I think. Oh, Brooklyn. And then what is this? Let's see. These are, it says current. I think the, well, I think these are the cards where you fold them and then there's envelopes in there. I'm not going to open this because this might end up in a future giveaway. Because I have so many cards. So, so many. Then I've got another one. This is, this is also closed and this is also the same sort of deal where you close, you fold the card and there's the envelopes. Never been opened. And then in here, stickers, stickers and more stickers. I think they're the same all the way through, but I don't know. So let me see. Looks like they're the same. I'm really trying. My dog is on my lap. Yeah, it's the same. They're all the same. My dog is on my lap trying to eat everything that I open. So I'm trying to like speed through this. All right, the next bag that I got, this one was for $1.88. There's the price right there. Uh, so this one looks like it came with some greeting cards and some ribbon that I'll never use. So let's check it out. Here's the ribbon that I'll never use probably might be sending this off to somebody else or it'll be put in a giveaway and then I've got what is this a door cover decoration this is I guess for your front door and it's a big Santa so oh no that's quite interesting hold on just a moment okay I'm back sorry about that my little dog decided to um, start getting into my stuff. But she's still right here. She's still right here looking. See what I drop. She's so very excited. Okay, and here's another door panel. So 
So this is for your front door or well, maybe a bedroom door. It looks, I don't know if it's interior or outside. It says for indoor and outdoor use. So I've got this one so far and then I have um, this Santa one. These will probably go, um, you know, maybe if I get a bunch of them in, in giveaways for next year, I guess. Um, here is little um, gift bags with the snowman on it. They're just little, little gift bags that you fill up with goodies and send off in friend mail, maybe. Not the right time of year for that. Uh, what is this? I have no idea. No, nope, for Glenn, no, no, no. So let's see if I can open this, figure out how to open it. Oh, I don't have to figure out how to open it because it's open. What are these, just red bags? Yeah, these are just red little paper bags for um, treats or whatever. So that's what those are. And then more greeting cards for Christmas. Season's greetings, these are all the same. And then the envelopes. And then more, let's see. Ah, Brooklyn, no, no, no. This is pretty. Kind of a raised card here, silver. Whoops, oh, there goes the dog. There she goes, so I got two of those. And two envelopes for those. Okay, and then, oh, I got actually, actually three of those. So there's another one. And the envelope. I'm sticking everything over on my table over there as I'm opening it. And then I just got a, a card. It doesn't even look like this has an envelope unless I stuck it over there already. But um, another Christmas card. So... And then, what else did we get in this one? Just something. Oh, God. Caught the dog running away. Yes, I did. This one is confetti. Confetti. Yay. Everyone likes a little confetti in their friend mail. Then, just some more cards. Some with angels. Is that angels? Yes. More angels. And more cards, more, more, more. You just don't know when to stop. So, we've got more greeting cards. I think they are all Christmas related. I'm assuming, oh, this one's pretty. The Cardinal. I believe that is the bird of Illinois, but um, that's where I live. So that's pretty. And then this one says Silent Night, Holy Night. So those are nice. Okay. And our last bag that I'm going to do very quickly is um, this one with $2.88. Let's see what's all in this one. This one doesn't look too Christmas related. Looks like a bunch of different things here. Oh, this is one of those little Dollar Tree mirror things. And the brush and mirror thing, I've seen these at the Dollar Tree. In fact, I've bought one of these. You push the brush out. I do have one of these. I used to carry it in my purse, and then I think I have misplaced it. So now I have another one. I mean, these do, I mean, I probably shouldn't be using it. I know you guys, I did this without thinking before cleaning it. Um... I'm sure if there was any lice on it, it's probably died off by now. <laughs> I should have rinsed it before, washed it before using it. Oh, well, you know, sometimes I think, most of the time I don't. Okay, these are men's Under Armour shoelaces. Why are they for men? I don't know. Okay, but Under Armour shoelaces, not bad. All right. Now, sheet grippers keeps bed sheets in place. Okay, that's not bad. When I first saw it, it was folded like this. 
And I'm like, suspenders? <laughs> Why would I need suspenders? Um, okay, but they are the sheet um, things to keep your sheets in place, which can come in handy. Especially on my side of the bed. I move around a lot and uh, my sheet's always coming up. Ooh, look at this little owl luggage tag. That is cute. We do go on um, about two vacations a year. So we're going to get use out of that, I'm sure. Here is a little turtle. I'm not sure exactly what it is. A mirror? It has a cellophane. It says it's $8.50. I mean, it's still sealed and all. I just, let's see what it is. I don't know. I'm, I'm guessing a mirror. That's what I'm guessing. Let's see if I can open it and we can we can take a, a closer look. Let's see if it opens up like a mirror. Okay, got it off. Not sure what Brooklyn has in her mouth. It's paper. She's got some paper still in her mouth. She's uh, having a blast chewing on it. Um, you know, I don't know what this is. Honestly, I, I don't think it's a mirror because it would pull up or something, wouldn't it? I don't want to break it. So until I figure out what this is, let's see. Ah, look it. It would help if I just read this. It is a car air freshener visor clip oh so i put this on my visor and an air freshener it's probably so old it's from bath and body works scent portable bath and body works huh okay well it doesn't really smell like anything anymore. I don't know what it was supposed to smell like. Maybe you're supposed to add scents to it or something. I'll have to look that up. But yeah, something from, I mean, this is a good little bag of all sorts of things. Okay, this is a mini stereo speaker, lightweight and stylish. A mini stereo speaker. This says it's got a foldable jack. To use, connect the audio jack to your audio source. The speaker has no amplifier function. I don't know. I'm going to have to let my husband look at this. I mean, it's cute. I don't think it's going to really have any functional value to any of us, but it says it's compatible with PCs, MP3 players, CD players, and mobile phones. Hmm. Okay. Well, it's probably just... One of those speaker things that, you know, it looks like, though, you have to plug that one in. I like the ones that just charge and don't have to plug them in. Okay, I got a little, a little wallet here, a little blue, kind of bluish wallet here. Um, it's kind of like the, a jean material on the inside, kind of a fake leather maybe on the outside. It, it does not look worn down or used. Um, so, no, nope, there goes my dog. She hears the other dog barking downstairs and then she has to bark too because that's the cool thing to do. Okay, anyway, I don't see a name brand on that, but who cares? All right, then what is this? Oh, a bottle care, a bottle. Uh oh, here's the dogs. Okay, I'm back. All right, so this is a bottle caddy. You turn any soda bottle into a canteen. Convenient snap-on collar with strap attaches easily to most beverage bottles. So here is this little contraption. Don't know. She looks happy using it though, look. She looks so happy. So I wonder if I use this, I'll be happy. It's um, with uh, the name of the company is Bright Concepts. So I don't know. Hmm. All right. 
Moving on, what else is in this little thing of goodies? I got a Car Fragrance Refill Crisp Morning Air from Bath and Body Works. Look, I wonder if this goes with this thing. Well, of course it does, right? Of course, of course, of course. I bet you just put it in here somehow and open that up and put this on your visor. So, okay, so it came with one of the um, air fresheners. I don't know how old it is again, though, you guys. The stuff might be pretty old. I don't know. Here is a, um, by, I think it's Aussie is the name of the, you know, company. Uh, it, you know, they have shampoos and conditioners. This is Three Miracle Moist Deep Conditioner. Again, don't know um, expiration dates. I know things expire like this, pretty sure. I have tons of things like this. Still smells good, but I have tons of things like this too in my, um, you know, room, just like uh, this size, travel size. And some of them have been since I, since I signed up for Birchbox years ago. I mean, Birchbox is one of the first boxes that I've ever signed up for. It is the first box. And I think I still have stuff from way back then. I mean, there's no expiration dates on anything. So, I just go and I open something, and if it's still good, I use it, and if it's bad, I just throw it away. Um, okay, then I got uh, another car fragrance refill. Um, this one's Sweet Pea. Don't know what this smells like, but that's also for my little turtle. I got this from Ulta Beauty, this shiny sheer lip gloss. I um, will not use this. I think I'm going to throw it away. It is not wrapped up in anything. Uh, if it was still wrapped up with the cellophane and stuff, I would probably, well, I would keep it, but it's not. So I don't know if someone's used this. I don't know if somebody's like swatched it to see what color it is on their body. Um, so unfortunately, this is going in the trash. That's trash. I won't even try it. I don't want to use other people's lip products. Um, and I believe this is a nail polish. So this I'll use. Even if somebody has used it before me, I will use it. So it's just a little glitter nail polish. Ooh, it is pretty. It is pretty. That's very pretty. Okay. So this video so far as I'm looking is about 20 minutes long. I doubt very much many of you um, watched all the way through, uh, but if you did, I thank you. I thank you very much for watching this whole video. Um, I'm going to be cutting down on a lot of boxes, like all of them, except the ice cream beauty box. And I also kept my um, single swag box. So, those are the only two boxes that I'm keeping. I, I'm going to do my channel like I always do my channel, but there's going to be less, what are they called? The beauty boxes. There's just going to be less. I'm going to have to just be more creative, I guess. Uh-oh. <laughs> We're all in trouble now. Anyway, thank you everyone for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up. Please comment down below and um, subscri uh, subscribe. I stumbled through that one. Subscribe. That would be very helpful. Thank you very much, everyone. Bye.